Mamgom. I want to know something actually. Is uh, what is the one thing that you love about me? <laughs> you know what? Because uh, fame comes and goes, money comes and goes, aesthetic comes and goes, you know. Um, but you know, and I always say this to you, I love your heart. Um, you are just the kindest, sweetest person ever. So generous, so selfless. It's your heart. Um, and for me in a marriage or any relationship, any relationship actually, whether it's a friendship, siblings, family, whoever, you know, romantic relationship, that's the most important thing, one's heart. And you just truly have an honest, good, God-fearing heart. And I'm not going to, I don't know if it's the hormones, <laughs> but I'm not going to get emotional about that. <laughs> Yeah, but um, I, I love you for your heart. You're just a good person. Yeah. Another question that I'd like to ask you is, uh, when did you realize that I was the one? Like, yeah? <laughs> you know, the moment I realized I was in love with you was when you backed off a bit to give me time to realize if, if I do truly love you, of course, you know, the way I was brought up as a girl, you never act desperate. You don't, you know, chase, <laughs> do the chasing. Uh, but I think once I, I started IT Brady and you're like, hey, listen, I'm going to give you some time. It's okay. You know, that's when I realized, like, no, <laughs> wait, but I actually do love you. <laughs> we can make this work. Um, and it was beautiful. I think the most important thing is, that I always knew you loved me, but then you really saw, <laughs> it was like the table said, how much, sure, I loved you. But I always did love you and I just didn't realize because I'd like do crazy stuff like fetch you for no reason and we were friends from like the Khao train station, you know? Um, yeah, just so I always loved you. I just didn't realize that, you know, like I'm actually in love with this person. Um, but it didn't take that, I mean, it took us about like three months for me to realize our courting was quite quick. Long. Quick! Three months is quick! Oh. Long! Anyway. <laughs> so yeah, so it wasn't, it wasn't that long at all, yeah. All right, this one is just, yeah, so relax, man. The best times or time you've had with me. Um, that's very tricky because we had a we've had a lot of good times, you know that. But I'll say, okay, for one, for me personally, was when I gave birth to Shaga. That was the most beautiful time ever. Again, I hope my hormones aren't gonna kick in, just because like you recorded yourself becoming like you were a doctor. You were like, hey guys, I'm Doctor Zex. <laughs> you know, um, you know, I, I, I'm gonna take over, and you comforted me. There's nothing scarier than someone who's never been a mom before who's about to give birth. And that moment, you know that like there's no turning back moments? <laughs> and you were just so comforting. You held my hand. And I thought you'd be more nervous than me. And then seeing our son who looks exactly like you, so me giving birth to Zex, <laughs> was one of the best times of my life. <laughs> it really was. It was... It was so beautiful, I don't know. So that for me, the best time, and I think the best times are just when we smile and we're happy and we're having a good time. I think we are now more than ever, because uh, we really understand each other. We put in the work. Um, yeah, I think I love the fact that we, we, we're stronger than ever. And I think that's why we're even comfortable to speak like this. Uh, we really, you know, uh, it's great because like many relationships, uh, they always get challenged or people try to challenge them. But I think we, we, we've been very good by keeping it between us and just having a good time. You've never not loved me. Uh, I know you've wanted to marry me since day one, <laughs> you know. And that's why you've just made it amazing because you've always seen my worth. I've always seen your worth. 
I mean, dude, it's not even, it's beyond me. Like, my mom adores you, you know, like, we're not even family. <laughs> so we just, we've always had the best times. And I think the most important thing is my, even my family has seen that. Um, and that's why they love you too, for loving me. So we constantly have good moments. And they don't have to be lavish or glamorous or OTT. They're just like simple moments when you're at home, you know, chilling or playing the piano, just having family time. Yeah, those, those are the best moments for me. Mm -hmm.